Here's a finished job the laser just completed. I'm taking out right now, I'm taking out all the waste material from the cuts, and now I'm collecting all the parts and moving them to their respective bins. I have to clean the platform of all the little pieces of acrylic that it might get stuck in the grate or might obstruct the next piece of acrylic from laying perfectly flat against the platform and which could potentially if it's not laying flat make the laser crash into the piece of acrylic causing a lot of issues and either potentially damaging the laser which is not good so here I actually have to take out the protective film on each side of the piece of acrylic which prevents scratches and stuff during shipping so now I'm aligning it with the origin of the laser and the origin of the laser is the location of the laser. It's not the top left corner of the platform. So that way you can move your laser anywhere and it would still work. I have it pushed up against the a little guide on the back so it's parallel to the X axis perfectly. Um, here's the control panel and I'm clicking the repeat button which executes this previous job that it had just finished. Um, as you can see now it's cutting along the path that is desired and you can see that you can see the platform under through the crack and you can see it's cutting completely through. So the laser essentially just follows whatever path you give it and that could be from CAD software, Adobe Illustrator, Adobe Photoshop, whatever you have you can as long as it outputs a DFX file or in the case of Photoshop a BMP usually works the best that 30 I think 72 resolution um, that red laser is not the actual cutting laser it's just a reference laser the actual laser is invisible to the human eye so you can't see it but the red laser is there just to see where it's actually pathing over here is the control panel again and you can see the time of how long the job's been running for and the file whatever you named your job uh, here's a quick glance at the actual software all the green is the path at which the laser will travel and cut 